I always get really nervous to do curvy comment, but I always pick the one that I land on. I use commentpicker.com. Today's curvy comment is from Karma's Law. Have I gotten you before? Karma's Law. That sounds so familiar. They said hypocrisy at its finest, 1508, but it's okay for you to judge people that judge you. That just shows what kind of person you are. 1508, okay, well now I gotta go look because I don't know what they're talking about. Let me go to my YouTube and then I'm gonna go to 1508. Okay, this was in the video, cook with me and new plus size fashion haul. Okay, let's listen. Not a single one of these is a dress, so be proud of me, it is all shirts. I've come to realize, yes, I have, lymphedema in my lower abdomen and if you're going to judge me for that whether that be in a youtube video or out in public while i'm wearing a shirt because you can kind of see it not like physically see it because my pants are like covering it but if you're going to judge me for something like that that just goes to show like the kind of person you are not the kind of person i am you guys okay so are you talking about because i said that just shows what kind of person you are if you are i will stand by that point because I do feel like if you're judging someone based on how they look like physically like parts of their body that might be deformed or something in my opinion I feel like my body is deformed due to my weight and lymphedema and everything like that so I feel like if you are judging someone based on that that does goes to show the type of person you are and whether that be me judging them on their moral grounds and just like the sensitivity or the non-sensitivity or the lack of empathy or sympathy that they have within themselves then okay I just don't think that anyone should judge anyone based on someone's deformities or something that's wrong with them, whether that be mental illness or physical illness. So same with the vlog, that means it is time for a curvy comment. So let's do this. Today's winner is hello, goodbye. -er. Of course you have not changed. You thrive off of negativity and you know that gives you the most views to get that coin for Walmart crap. We should not give her the attention. She thinks she's going to get, honestly. All right, I'm sorry, but if I thrived off of negative attention because supposedly that gives me the most views, which then in retaliation would give me the most money, these are not the type of videos that I would be filming. It's just weird that anything that I do that people think is like cringy or whatever, which is just being me, people think that I'm trolling when I'm not. So it's like, if you guys think my whole life is like a big troll fest, that's just an opinion and it's not true. All right, you guys, it's that time. It's time for the curvy comedy, yeah. Are you making fun of me? A little bit. Okay, so the curvy comment is from Jacqueline Heaton and a chocolate cake pop. Then she makes that face. She knows that she's killing herself and she thinks it's a joke. Remember when she was smaller and admitted if things didn't change, she'd be dead before 40? It's getting real and it's terribly sad. So, um, yeah. Majority of this is true besides the part thinking it's a joke. I most definitely do not think that. Hey guys, so it's the end of the vlog. So that means it's time to pick a curvy comment. I have no idea what that was. Whew. Okay, so today's winner is Zeph. They said, I like how when we started praising Becky on her drawings, Amber has to show us her coloring books and connect the dots. Come on, really? Just let her shine for a minute and stop being jealous. Why am I not surprised? Of course you'd think that. So I'm the one who's constantly urging Becky, share your artwork, share your artwork. I praise Becky, I love Becky. I want people to see her art so bad. So why would I do something that would make me jealous? I want more and more people to see her artwork and I want more and more people to tell her how amazing she is. I've been trying to find more things that would like calm me down. I do suffer with anxiety and coloring does help with that. And my life is pretty bland, pretty boring. I'm vlogging every single day. And if I wanna show a coloring book, and what I did has nothing to do with my girlfriend. The curvy comment winner is a purple dragon lady. She said, don't you know how to buy a stool to step on and get in the bed? That simple. Salt causes swelling. Your videos are the same thing every time. There is one and boring. Thank you for your opinion. So there's three things to talk about here. Um, buying a stool to step on the bed. I'm able to get on the bed without a stool, so I don't need a stool. Salt causes swelling. Yes, it does. A lot of sodium causes swelling, especially when you have lymphedema. I'm holding on to a lot of fluid right now. It's just something I'm struggling with. Your videos are the same thing every time there is there is one and it's boring. So if you're bored, I think you should move on and find another YouTuber. There's plenty you can watch and I'm not even saying that in like a condescending or mean way. I legitimately don't know why people would watch anyone that they're bored by because I know for a fact I wouldn't. I watch a lot of vloggers and their life is a lot like mine. You know, it's just repetitive, everyday, normal living. I don't 
live my life for the vlog. I just simply vlog my life and there's a huge difference. If you wanna find a vlogger who is living their life to vlog, then I'm not the one. Um, there are a few on there who are extra on their videos just for the vlog, but that's not me. I'm just gonna sit here and show my life. And if you don't enjoy it, then don't watch. I personally prefer the vlogs that are like mine. Very just mundane, you know, hang out with your friends here and there, go shopping, show me what you eat, what are you doing around the house? Like those are just chill vlogs and that's kind of what I go for because that's my life. So anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog and I will see you in my next one, bye.